I guess it's a willow tree um, and trying here I'll try to get all of these picked up it's very hard as you can see it's like really intense in the lawn back there but um yeah so trying to do this currently with a small wheelbarrow so wish me luck um, thought I'd pull the camera out to show you because this is the first week in life as a homeowner so might as well show you but yeah, so sun's setting, it's like 6.30, 7. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna keep doing this until it's cleaned up more. It's just like, it was way worse. I got like a lot of them, but I wanna just keep going. So we'll see what we can get done. day from when I vlogged yesterday I think but um yeah I need to show you the um I need to show you what the finished product was of yesterday but you know what I thought about I have a bathtub finally this big bathtub and I have not used it yet it's been a week and I haven't used it a little disappointed in myself I could say but I want to go downstairs and show you some stuff really quick um in the house that we got done I want to show you the finished paint wall and some other stuff so I'm gonna do that I'm in the garage really quick but look at this so we found this on Facebook marketplace guess how much $20 yeah so it has like this ball in it and it's like a it reminds me of like a Coliseum or something but um if you can see it like I don't know it's the stone thing I don't know I I know you might not get the vision okay it does look kind of old person-y I have a vision and for $20 I couldn't like not get it you know what I mean but I have a vision with our couch that we got and a rug that we're gonna get I think it's going to look so good but um yeah so I'm really excited about that we went the other night at like 9 p.m. I saw it on Facebook for like $20 I was like okay no I need that and um so then we went and picked it up and now we have it but and then yesterday Oh, I have so many updates for you guys. I didn't obviously pull out the vlog camera during this, but um, here, let me go inside and show you. Okay, this is our laundry room, right? Everything is fine. All this stuff was on the ground. I feel like I've showed you that before because, you know, all of our cleaning stuff was on the ground. So I was running a load of laundry of wash, wa or I was washing stuff basically. And I, Jared's parents came here and I started hearing, that's like a alarm system for our house. And I started hearing it go off. And it was going off really, really, really loudly, like through these speaker things up here. And we all could not figure it out. Finally, I turned this way. The door was shut and I was doing laundry. And there was just steam coming out of here. And I walked in and it was like flooded, basically like, okay. It wasn't like, like flooded like too high or anything but it was like there was a pool of water all over the ground um like all over it got everything wet and it was coming from down here at first i thought it was coming from here but it's all gross down there but it was coming from there and that pipe right there if you can see it it's like rotted out um which we did not know and so that hose there going to the washing machine needs to be replaced it scared the actual crap out of us we it was dripping down through the vents into the basement so we have to figure all of that out now but, um, yeah, <sighs> we could not figure out how to get the water supply off to the whole house. Um, Jared's dad and him were downstairs trying to do it. His mom and I were upstairs trying to clean it up and everything. It was just, like, crazy. Um, but now we know because the old owner of the house is really, really sweet. And he gave us his phone number. And he, um, he like, built this house and knows, like, everything about it. And so when we texted him and asked, <clears throat> or Jack, I'm sorry, Jared called and asked, like, do you know where the, like, the water thing is? It's an emergency. Um, and he offered to come by really quick. And so he came over and helped 
um, Jared out down there. And it was really, really nice, and we're so thankful. And that's, like, not the first time he's helped us. He's just, like, really, really sweet. So we got him, like, a thank you card and a, um, a gift card because we're, like, we, you know, it was just really nice. We didn't know what else to do. He wouldn't let us pay him. But, um, yeah. So anyway, so those two things I wanted to show you. And then we're making progress through the kitchen. So my vision for this kitchen is completely different than what it is. It's, it's all blue right now, but it's going to be all white when I get done with it. White and black and, you know, like, we want to redo the countertops with white quartz. Um, and then the backsplash. I'm, we're trying to decide on the backsplash still. But that's going to be all redone. And then we just we ordered cabinet pull handle things for, like, the... Um, for like these cabinet pole things in the drawers. So we ordered those, they're gonna be coming this week. They're really cute. Um, and yeah, so I don't know what else. But oh, I wanna show you also my tree that I finished. Also finished this wall. Sorry, it's kinda dark in here. Wait, how do we fix that? Okay, so we also finished this wall. We did all of the white paint. We used bare um, in the color we used bear in the color polar bear. Um, we got the five gallon because we're gonna do like a lot of the house in this color. I just think it's like the perfect white. I don't know if you, you can you can even tell from this angle, but I don't know. But can you tell there the white? I don't know. Sorry, it's like backlit. But when it's in the rest of the house, you'll be able to tell. But did you see how many sticks were down there yesterday? I did that all, and then Jared um. Cut the grass if you can see how nice these little lines are. Looks so good now. Um, but yeah, that's our tree. And thank God it looks so much better. So yeah, so basically yesterday was a crazy day. We were we were like, what just happened? Um, I don't know. But I guess it has to happen. We now know how to turn the power off to the whole house and the um, water supply, which I think are just important things to know when you move in anywhere, even rentals. Um, like rental houses I think it's important to know that stuff so you can help yourself in like an emergency like that or a situation um so yeah sectional and so it's gonna go like pretty big in here and then we're gonna get a rug and then that coffee table right there oh my god and then eventually I want to redo this fireplace as well I'm telling you guys I'm annoying I I'm like I love interior design and I really want to just like redo everything <laughs> everything it's very pretty how it is um, I just want to change definitely out that tile and I also want to paint I think the surround black um, but like for little touches and then eventually I want to redo the whole fireplace around here and now we're talking about it yesterday we kind of want like more of like a moderny look I don't know we're just thinking some different ideas but yeah and then we're gonna get like curtains to go all the, all the way around here Something's coming. Very exciting things coming. And I have these bananas that are sitting here that need to be put away so Okay guys, I'm making those um, little balls again. And I just eyeballed it and honestly, I think it worked out better this time. Like, remember like last time it was so dry. This time, it, I think it's going to be like perfect. Um, so yeah, I just eyeballed everything and I actually added chia seeds in it this time. So I'm just gonna like put them in balls and lay them out on here. But so we're gonna see how they turn out. And they're done, I'm so excited. They taste really freaking good. Um, they're like nice and like moist, so they made really good balls. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna put those in the fridge and let them like get all cold and everything. But yeah, I'm excited about them. Okay guys, I just went to my mailbox and I got um, a pair of blue light blocking glasses because I constantly get headaches. First of all, while I work on my computer, you know I work like um, off of my laptop all the time and also plus that I watch YouTube videos and like Netflix all the time and stuff and then also I just got a new switch which I haven't told you guys about um, Jared surprised me with, with a switch uh, light and I have Animal Crossing now so more to come on that but I wanted to open up this box with you guys um, I, they are from Hip Optical, and they actually reached out and sent them to me, which is really sweet of them, so thank you guys so much. They came really fast, I have to say, um, I don't know if that's their regular shipping time, but, like, it came really quickly, which 
is awesome. And they have really, really cute styles on there. I was actually, um, I couldn't pick <laughs> which ones that I wanted. Um, and I honestly might order a couple more pairs from them because I want some for like all over the house. Like when I have a pair of glasses, I like them all over, especially like blue light blocking where I can like watch TV with them on and um, stuff like that. But let's see here. Okay. Okay, cute. Their branding is really cute and that their website was really nice to like go through as well. Thought I should mention. Oh my gosh. Wow, they come with like a nice case too. Like that. Let's see. I think I got really cute ones and hopefully they fit my big face. That was something nice about their website. If you scroll down, like you don't have to look very far to find like the width because I have like a wide face, so I always have to find like wide or regular or whatever. Um you know but okay okay so this is what they look like when you open it okay it comes with a little cleaner thing too which is nice and it has their thing embossed on it very nice quality oh my god Ooh, cute oh my god i'm so excited i've been wanting like a pair of glasses this shape so you can see like the blue light blocking they feel like really good quality i have um, a pair, they're downstairs, but I have a pair of glasses from other places, and these feel, like, really nice. Okay, let's see. Oh, they fit, okay, they fit really well. Oh, I'm, like, obsessed with these. Ooh. See, they had this, and they had another more circular pair, and they had, like, a really thick pair. This is the shade, or another shade. This is the, let me find it. Oops. Sorry, I just looked it up, but this is the pair called Wagner. Um, I really like them. I feel like they're really modern, and I have always been obsessed with clear glasses for like the past six years. But um, yeah, I got them with no prescription because I don't really need a prescription. Technically, I do, but it always messes with my eyes. I need to get, get it like rechecked or whatever, but okay, I really like these. I like the, the glasses case too. Awesome, I'm so excited about these. Because now when I'm playing my Switch, my eyes will not be um, compromised. So, love it. Oh my god, I've been wanting a pair of these. I think I talked about it a while ago um, with you guys. And I told you, like, oh my god, I want a pair of blue light blocking glasses. So bad. But yeah, so thanks for sending me them, Hip. And I think you guys should definitely check them out. Um because they feel really nice and like I said they came really quick and I like their website a lot so yeah but anyway um also I do have a discount code for you guys um it's ten dollars off with code jordan10 so yeah check out the link in the description and check it out um for your own pair of blue light blocking glasses yeah, they have other stuff besides blue light blocking glasses as well they have sunglasses and regular glasses and different things like that so just wanted to let you know I do have a code for you guys um let's see what was I gonna say Believe it or not, it's the next day. Um, yeah. And in the same outfit, I put the same shirt back on. I'm wearing different pants at least, so that's progress. Um, same, same glasses because I really am enjoying them. And anyway, um, we're getting our TV hung today, which I'm super, super excited about because that's like the, the, like the beginning process of our family room getting done. Um, because we have that and then the TV or the couch is coming and then I want to order a rug which I've been looking at online um well Jared and I have been I don't I, I say me but it's it's us making the decisions obviously but um yeah but yeah so I've been doing that I've been doing a lot of online shopping um checking out H&M and Sephora and different house stuff because I'm just in a shopping mood and I can't go out and shop so it's kind of sucks but whatever anyway uh, not the point. Let's see. What was I going to say? But yeah. And I've been shopping on Miss A. Which I I have an order. I'm, I think I'm going to put it through like right now. But um, I saw it on TikTok like a while ago. Like this $1 foundation. And I tried it. And it literally was my favorite foundation ever. If you watched like my makeup videos or anything. You would see that that's like the one that I used mostly. And yeah, I really like it. Um, and of course they're sold out of my color in that, but I got like a bunch of different 
other things in my cart. I got like 10 things for like $10 or nine things for like $10 and then like $3 shipping. So like 14 ish dollars. Um, yeah, amazing. So I'll let you guys know in future vlogs when that comes because I'm so excited. And then I wanted to order some skincare stuff too, but, but here, let me show you like my, my miss AOR. Um, we shall see how that goes. I also have some deliveries happening today. I have my sister's birth, one of my sister's birthday presents being delivered today, um, which I'm so excited about. Um, I think she's going to love all of her gifts that we got her, but yeah. And then what else did I think? Oh, and then a housewarming gift for my, my son-in-law. No, not my son-in-law. My brother-in-law to be, um, Jared's brother. I could have just said Jared's brother. Um, that's coming. Um, and let's see. Let me go to Gmail. I can look up when. But uh, I can do that later. Currently making a nice coffee. Um, and I'm trying to use the rest of this creamer because I just I'm still trying to find a creamer I like. Has this not been like an ongoing thing <laughs> on my vlog since I started vlogging? But whatever. Um, and my hair is like all flipped out weird. I don't even. I don't even care. Threw on a. Um, you're on a hoodie, sorry, I'm about to talk loud, I'm a talk maker, and then leggings. This is just every day. It's the same outfit every day, but I'm not complaining because this is comfortable, okay? And then my slippers, amazing. Here, my nice coffee. Gotta put the liquids in. There's a lot. A uh, straw. Amazing reusable straws. Let's taste it. Okay. Hopefully this will take my migraine away. I have like a bad, um, sorry. I have a bad migraine today. And I think it's because, I think that it's because I um, have been sitting in my bed working and like my head is so sensitive. Is anyone else's like this? But anytime, like, I'm, like, sitting on it weird, like, for a long time, like, because I've been sitting sitting up on my bed, but then this is, like, against my headboard. And so it didn't start hurting my head because we're waiting to get our couch in. And that's basically our only furniture that we have to sit on. So that's where I've been working. Um, so, yeah, hopefully this can take it away, this coffee, or help a little. Tastes good. I need more ice in it though. So we're gonna do that. All right, much better. This is perfect. Um, now I need to edit this vlog as well and get it up. I have been trying so hard to keep my schedule, my video schedule, um, but you know, you know, things happen. Gotta get through this too, so. I want to find a place for all of this stuff so that I can stop looking at it um, and move on with like projects like we want to paint and um, get new doors, do renovate, you know what I mean? And it's like the, the unpacking part is annoying. I want to get to the fun part. But it's okay, patience is a virtue. It'll pay off, it'll be worth it. Um, no rush, there's no rush. That's what I need to remember. I just am so excited that there's a rush. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I like make myself in a rush because I'm so excited to do everything. But anyway, so I'm going to enjoy this. Um, I don't know what else I'm going to do. I don't even know what time it is. I'm going to eat maybe. I'm really hungry. Um, but besides that. Listen. I don't know if you can hear that, but that's a train faintly in the background. It's like my favorite thing about living here that I've noticed is that we get to hear a train like once in a while. It's like far enough to where it's not annoying, but like close enough to where it's like you can hear it still. So, or at least from our room. So, I just wanted to put that in there. Okay, guys, I just got back from the store and I was just unloading. I unloaded all of like my fresh stuff and like my frozen stuff, but I wanted to show you what else I got. Um, well, I'll just show you even what I got in here. So I got like this cauliflower rice. 
I don't know if this is interesting or not to show you, but I thought it might be interesting. I don't know. I just did like a medium-sized grocery run. Um, cauliflower rice and then some like easy seasoned Brussels sprouts. Just like stuff that's easy to just heat up, but still healthier. And then I also got this Alexia loaded cauliflower. Um, I'm so intrigued by this. Only 100 calories per serving and five grams of carbs and zero sugar. So that's kind of exciting. I think it'll taste good for sure. I've had that brand before of like their, their other stuff and it was good. So yeah. And then I got just a cauliflower, or cauliflower, <laughs> an onion, avocado, asparagus, kale, little potatoes, because I want to make smashed potatoes, not mashed potatoes, but smashed. Um, and then, um, yeah, I already said avocado. Now I'll go back through here. I got a bunch of these random drinks. If you don't know, like, I'm obsessed with just things that I can grab and drink. Um, so I got this Smart Water Strawberry Blackberry. And then the Zevia Zero Calorie Energy Mango and Ginger. I don't know. Mango and Ginger sound like a good combination. So, yeah. Um, where else did I put this? I got... Two of these Carb Masters, because I really like them. They are only a dollar, first of all, at Kroger, and they're only 90 calories, seven carbs, six carbs, um, five grams of sugar, just an easy, like, yogurt snack, basically. Um, let's see. Sorry. And then I also got one of my unhealthy things that I got. I've been liking like as my snack of the day, I'll have like one little like treat um, and or like not even every day, just like once in a while. But I got the snack pack because they come in just like the easy like serving size bags and they're like the hot ones. So I thought I'd try that this week just to um, have. So yeah, because you can always, that's a, a thing. It's all about balance. You have to work like your cravings in or just like you can have fun with your week still like we're in quarantine you can have a little bit of like a snack um and what i was gonna say is you can work everything into like your nutrition facts for the day then i got this tiava tiava um unsweetened tea mint I got that one for jared and then i got this one for me the non-carbonated orange rockstar these are my favorites um i just have like one randomly. I only got one of them. And then I got these sugar-free Tropicana um, Tropicals. Not Tropicana. Tropicals. Hawaiian Pineapple, um, Charcoal Orange, and Caribbean, Caribbean Fruit Punch. Oh my god. But they are really, really good. And no sugar. I got this to try too just because it's newer at the store and I've been wanting to try it for a while. It's a Silk Espresso Almond and Oat Latte. Dairy free coffee beverage. I don't know. I'll let you guys know what I think about that. I don't know if I'm gonna like it or not, but but we shall try and see. I just got another little regular milk because we already had almond milk and I just needed like that for a recipe. So that's why I got that. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna keep those out. And then I got this Arizona Diet Green Tea which is zero sugar, just green tea, easy to pour and have chilled. And then the last bag, let's see, I got eggs, these large brown cage-free eggs. I'll put those right there to fit perfectly because my eggs were going bad. And then I got these, they were only $3. Sc stuffed scallops, I guess they stuffed them already at the Kroger um, counter and yeah, I'm really excited for these. Actually, I might make them tonight. So yeah, then I got. Oh, I love, I love these things. These are really good. Um, I, whatever. It's just the light shining through. But if you are a bariatric um, student, patient, um, post-op, pre-op, whatever, or you just like to drink water and you need to get your water in, um, these are really good. They're zero sugar. Um, anything like this. Um, it has zero sugar actually I've tried like a lot and they're really good the starburst all pink I have the all blue one from starburst really yummy and then I tried this pink lemonade one which I feel like I've tried before 
but yeah, there's only five calories in this one, 10 calories in this one, no carbs, no sugar, or whatever. Um, well, this has two carbs, but whatever, not the point. The point is, it's good if you want something other than just plain water. You know what I mean? That's what I, I don't know, I, I'm really bad about just drinking plain water, so yeah. Then I got this deli sliced um, smoked turkey. I love the deli sliced ones. It's just, I don't know what, it's just like, it's just fresh. I don't know, I just like it. Well, and then I also got, oh my god, I totally forgot. I got these, this um, smoked salmon to put with this um, chive and onion, like cream cheese, love that. And I also got center cut bacon. Let's see, what else? I got powdered sugar, mozzarella to go with everything. And then, um, okay, has anyone tried this Pellini, Pellimini, Heart of Palm Linguini? Um, it's made out of heart and palm, heart of palm. And there's only 20 calories, four grams of carbs and no sugar. And I guess it's like an alternative to pasta. So I got this to make with, um, I got pesto just cause I've been wanting pesto. And then I got Alfredo to make with it. And I think I was gonna make like my own little mixture of stuff, but I'm really excited for that. I think it's gonna taste good. I've heard of this. I don't remember if I heard good or bad, but and then I got this dark chocolate if I wanted a little piece of dark chocolate ever. Um, let's see, I got spray olive oil. What else, what else? Um, one Lunchable, because these are just easy if I'm like busy that day. Um, just pepperoni and mozzarella, just easy to grab and eat uh, with crackers. Well, the crackers are in there. That's what I mean, like you can just grab it and I can bring it to my desk or whatever. And then I got Jared a mac and cheese box. <laughs> But yeah, so that's it for that. Sorry. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd just show you that really quick. Now I gotta put this all away. Okay, so it's not the most organized, but this is the fridge. Have everything in there. All of my little fresh things my whatevers, whatevers, and then those are those things that I made the other day. So good to just grab and go. Um, Domino's boxes from our little dinner the other day. This is so good. It's the Natural Hunts. Okay, I don't know why I'm showing you this stuff, but I just thought I would while it's nice and clean up there. <laughs> uh, let's see what else. And that's our freezer. Not much going on, but you know what? And then here's our pantry. Pretty, pretty boring if I do say so myself. I'm still trying to organize it. I have not organized it yet. Like right here I have all my pastas, the canned good and extra sauces and stuff like that. But, but yeah, anyway, um, I'll let you guys go. And I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And subscribe to my channel down below. Follow me on Instagram and give me a like on this video if you enjoyed it. So Thanks again. Bye, guys.